advised. You are entering United Colony space. Please maintain course and prepare to be scanned. All right, we're done. You are cleared to land at New Atlantis. Stop by the Trade Authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. I would try to viewport. They'll be on your left once you get into the plaza. Everything looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. Aesthetically pleasing, or so Barrett has told me. New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. city. But Constellation is an entirely neutral entity. It always has been. Here we are, the lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. Your spinal health will be compromised by carrying so many items. Just 
inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now. We appear to have a visitor. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Uh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Matteo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. There. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But the country, if you expect us to believe in fairy tales. If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have... The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. That's it. Just like the others. And to imagine, we thought there were only two of them at first. Oh my god, that's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proves Easy, that. girl. Breathe. You have a hunt attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager? That's right. You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend? <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just mind your head. was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for you right now. I guess a lot overwhelming, now that I think about it. There, I'm Noel. Greetings. It's really Walter nice to meet you. And thank you for you. bringing the artifact to uh, us. No, I don't need anything. Just, uh, checking in. Seeing how you're doing. Planning on sticking Access. around then? Good! I think we can find well a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Well, Right. So you've seen the of library, course. obviously. I have been given Walter's no quite proud of the collection, but Matteo has made more than a few contributions. Gardens are out the doors there, if you need a moment of quiet contemplation. Emphasis on the quiet part, at least usually. Let's head upstairs. Sebastian Banks, Constellation's founder, had this place built decades ago. It was a big to-do at the time, but most people in the city have forgotten we're here. I am at your service, Captain.
Stolen any sacred relics recently? Very funny one. So this is the bar. Usually no tender, so help yourself. Within reason, of course. Now let's see about that room. You're in luck. We were almost at max occupancy already, but there's still one room up for grabs. It's been nice having the place so full. Okay, this will be you. Common room on one side, so that'll be quiet, and Mateo on the other side, so maybe a little less quiet. I'm sure Sarah has something planned for each of us, so I... I'm listening. So, are you ready to get to work? Or was there something else? We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. And wind up crabby. Or, my personal favorite, irascible. Jumping to anthropology on me already? Oh, well, good. We all need our own reasons to be out there. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself, and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact, or this lead runs dry. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before, or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every member of Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? Trust you're still satisfied with your choice to join Constellation, Noel? Yes, ma'am, of course. I honestly can't imagine being anywhere else. You've been an invaluable asset to the group, Noel. Just wanted to make sure you didn't regret it. It's not always easy, but I just remind myself that if it weren't for you and for Constellation, I'd have no idea that any of this was going on. As much as I love uncovering new questions, I wouldn't mind a few answers now and then. Ever since I got here, this has felt like home. Stay safe, okay? Sarah, good to see you. Who's your friend? Hopefully Constellation's newest member. Thought I'd run through some legwork together. Oh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? Oh, sorry, but no. UC citizenship is all earned based on service. They should have covered this in your civic lessons. Go figure. All right, all right. Can't blame me for trying, right? I mean, I still haven't given up on getting Sarah to re-enlist. It's a game we play. He asks. I say no. Here's what I got for you two. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which Admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. 
Soul System has a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. I'm serious about that recruitment offer, by the way. You just come talk to me when you're ready. UC is a good friend to have. Faces passing through here. He ain't been around. Went off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. I oh, believe me, I heard it. After about round three or four, it was all he would talk about. And he's got a voice that carries. Look. Nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian. Especially when it's missing. But... <clears throat> he has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular, but... If I'm not all that money, I got problems. What do you say? You're a little short on funds there. Come back when you got the credits. Can't say I'm a fan of excitement and drama around here. You got those credits? You pay his tab. I'll tell you what I know. No, I've done this routine. Let's skip to the part where you admit you're lying about what he owes. You calling me a liar? I'll throw both of you out of this bar right now. Oh, please. Two strangers arrive from Offworld asking for information only you have. You see an opportunity. Everyone always does. Lower the price. Don't think we can't find another way to get what we want. Fine. Agreed on a discount, right? Let me confirm the amount. Okay. Let's talk. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love. Singing songs. All that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? 
fine. We'll make do. Got cold beers and good atmosphere.
I'm heading to the Nova Galactic Storyard orbiting Earth's moon. Yeah, yeah, I know. The whole place is decommissioned. But I need parts for emergency repairs. Hopefully it hasn't been picked clean yet. Well, that's not good. Earth and everything around it. Pleasant change of scenery. Two steps in, and we're already looking at a corpse. Okay, it's not Vanguard Moara. Looks like spacers were scavenging around here, and someone else came in and said hello. Oh, this won't be your last encounter with the spacer crew. They pillage abandoned facilities and shoot anyone who gets in their way. They're even less organized than the Crimson Fleet. Just countless desperate groups scavenging and killing to survive.
some more.
star yards. Have something for me? It's Neptune neck. Feel free to drop some stuff into my bag.
for a damn joke. I got to meet whoever you two are. Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories too. About a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is. I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? Hey, I'll trade some weird space rock for a rescue anytime. Hope you figure out whatever that thing is. Let's grab the artifact. Stabilized. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here. You've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. We're going to do great things together. All of us. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm going to be out there for it. And I want you out there as well. You got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. All right. We've got a few more leads we should talk about. First, there's an expedition that Sam Co has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been hard at work tracking down more anomalies. And last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it, no other word. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. We maintain a star station in orbit above us. It's where we do all our deep space scanning. Vladimir runs the station. Brilliant astronomer. Years of practical experience. Oh, that's right. He wasn't here when you first showed up. He should be back by now. I'll let him handle the introductions. If I steal his thunder, I'll never hear the end of it. His mind is always somewhere, but there's no arguing his knack for being in the right place at the wrong time. Oh, too bad he couldn't see the artifacts coming together. But knowing him, he'll be so excited when he gets a look, it won't occur to him that he's missed anything. Until later. I am at your service, Captain.